This should be one to savour. Manchester City get the contest underway. And it's gone behind for the corner. The clearance wasn't decisive. De Bruyne. Foden. Erling Haaland. Oh, wonderful goalkeeping. Well, you have to say, from that sort of distance, that's a wonderful save. Well, as a defender, that will sit. Can they forge ahead? Well, really, making the goalkeeper's life simple. That should be hit in the back of the net. That was a big, big chance. And that puts them in position. Digne. Textbook defending inside the box. An incisive pass. Oh, yes! 1-0 it is. And it doesn't come as a huge surprise. And back underway. 1-0 it is. De Bruyne. And return to Silva. Will he finish? And another one! Two quick goals! Will it turn out to be the two-punch knockout? So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Bernardo Silva. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. He's got the right idea with that pass. Now the attack fizzled out. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Well, it fizzled out. A bit of running room now on the wing. Oh, fantastic effort. He made great contact, but the keeper more than equal to it. Surely. Oh, that is a majestic goal. Volleyed home with precision and style. Superbly done. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the scoreline. And the first... Away they go again. Second half is underway here. And attempting the through ball. Chilwell. It's with Laporte. Happy just to retain the ball in their own half and draw out the opposition. Andre Kramaric. Oh, big chance. Intelligent threaded pass here. Foden. On to De Bruyne. It's neat passing. Confidence on the ball. Chilwell. Beautiful pass. In position. Crucial interception amid impending danger. Holland. Holland. Well, that is going to go down as an own goal by the keeper. So, an own goal, and now they are chasing this game. Saka. And now, Stones. And Bernardo Silva has it. And the keeper more than equal to it. It comes to nothing in the end. And a significant block following that cross. Bellingham. Can he play it in? John Stones. Can he finish? Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Well, there's the final whistle.
Thank you all for your patience. We're going to start taking questions now. Thanks for coming, everyone. A derby that has always been important to locals, now a fixture on the national, indeed international stage. Stay tuned and we'll bring you all the action from the Northwest as Manchester City face Manchester United. It is a rivalry that runs all the way back to 1881 and City and United are on a collision course today. Welcome to our live coverage of the Manchester Derby. This is Derek Ray in the commentary position, joined by Stuart Robson. It should be fantastic, Stuart. Well, it should be a classic, Derek. There's some great players on view here today, on both sides, and the rivalry just makes it that little bit more special. So they start at 11 for Manchester City. Ederson stands between the posts. Kyle Walker plays with Ben Chilwell in the fullback positions. And the lone striker today is Erling Haaland. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. Marcel Zabitza plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And the game begins. United could get in behind the defence, but nothing comes of it. Foden. Walker. And a chance, Kyle Walker. And there it is. Here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. But you do have to ask questions of the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't be beaten at your near post like that. Action underway once more. Let's see if United have the wherewithal to square the game. Good use of advantage in United's favour. Well, the hosts will be determined to claim all three points, and they know if results go their way, they could end the day at the summit, Stuart. Well, at this stage of the season, Derek, the table starts to reflect the true quality of the teams, and I have to say, they've been excellent so far. Let's hope they're at their best today. Laporte. Bernardo Silva. Chance to cross. 
Holland. Foden. Leal. On to Holland. Oh, good reflexes from the keeper and the danger averting. Short corner it is. Body in the way. A oh, very effective play, and they might be onto something. Anthony. United finding space on the wing. Zabica. Now with Turam. Surely the equaliser. Well, he gave it real leather, but miles off target. Now, what's the keeper playing at? No strong hand on the ball. Out of play for a Manchester City throw in. Rafael Leao. Laporte. The ball with Rodri. Well, they're quite content to knock it around inside their own half. In with a chance. And up for grabs off the keeper. And they can't quite take advantage in the end. Well, what a great save that was to keep them in this. May just be the impetus they need, as they certainly haven't been at their best today. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Fernandes he's beaten his man can they cover up well really calm composed goalkeeping there it certainly was on the second attempt it was the first save that really stood out that was a brilliant piece of goalkeeping City pushing forward with options available splendid defending and it needed to be Bernardo Silva surely and still danger here well, nothing comes of it. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. In the right place to cut out the pass. Leal. Can he put it away? He's blocked it! Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. Easy save. And that is going to be all for the first 45 then here at the Etihad Stadium. Well, a lot to like about... Second half underway with City looking to build upon a positive first half performance. Rodri. Now Holland. It's looking promising. Now delivering that deep cross. Still not clear. And a time for calm on the ball. Leal. Pressing high, and they have the ball again. Well, it could be on for him here. And a goal it is for Manchester City. They are the team on course for victory. Let's have a look at the replay. What a through ball this is by Haaland, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. So back underway, but the scoreline standing at 2-0. Bernardo Silva. Well, City, as the stats highlight, 
have had most of the ball. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Indeed, perhaps they can cash in again. Let's see. Can he take the chance? A goal! Another one! It's turning into an absolute demolition job. Well, we can take another look now. It's wonderful interplay between the two of them to start the move. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. So the action continues, and City really cantering to victory here. Foden. Can he find the net? It's a perfect challenge. Anthony. And it should be a tremendous Carabao Cup quarter-final. You can see it live with us here on EA TV. It's Manchester City facing Bournemouth. Oh, Derek, big moment here. A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. Well, here it is again, and they've taken their goal well, but the defending was non-existent. That should never happen. A lopsided contest, 4-0. 20 minutes to go in this one. Fernandes. Back for Sancho. Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes! Quite simply, an opportunity wasted. Easy for the keeper. They've regained possession. Casemiro. Rodri. Don't forget we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's Manchester United facing Nottingham Forest. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. They need to get bodies back. It might be. A goal! How about that? He's put it away to make it a hat-trick. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And Holland. made the finish look easy as he so often does it's a lovely goal it's a massive lead and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now Casemiro and the free kick awarded to Manchester United And we've entered the final five minutes. Rodri. The supporters want to see him have a go. Misfiring completely. Yeah, he's gone for power, but the contact was never right. It's a poor effort, really. unable to pick out a teammate and that'll be a throw and if you're wondering about added time two minutes it'll be Bukayo Saka John Stones on to De Bruyne can they put it away And there goes the final whistle. A real sense of feel-good for City fans everywhere. They take the three points from... And this conference...
And now they get the ball rolling. And threading it forward. That is really alert defending just when the situation looked dangerous. City moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? Well, they've managed to get away with it in the end, Stuart. Yeah, he's recovered it well, but that was a really poor mistake to start with. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Stones. It's with Gundogan. Well, high marks for that pass. And the goalkeeper expertly anticipated that through ball. And taking it away. Gives it a go. And the post denied him. And he did what he... It needs an accurate cross. And clears his lines. Big chance. In it goes. At the second time of asking. And the keeper feels hung out to dry. So City get things going again. And the onus is on them to erase the damage done by that concession. Marcus Tavernier. Oh, breezing past him. Real chance. And a decent save. Full credit. It's a short one. Well, space if he goes inside. Stanislas. Conti. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Well, there it is. Second half underway, and no doubt about it, City with work ahead of them. Well, visionary passing, and it all counts for naught. Marcus Tavernier, Kiefer Moore. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. And it's gone in, just what was needed for Manchester City, who now have squared it. Well, here it is again. The little one-two starts it all off. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. So back underway, they've levelled it at 1-1 here. And he's in. Oh, that's magnificent goalkeeping. And now we find out it was offside anyway. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Jude Bellingham. And don't forget, we have more Premier League action coming up for you on EA TV. It's Bournemouth facing Fulham. What a chance this is, Derek. Oh, a vital piece of last-ditch defending. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Will they profit from this situation? But quick thinking defensively. Well, the supporters think it's on. And saved by the keeper. the challenge that was required and foxing the defender and making high pressing work for them here a routine save Jack Grealish and Bellingham well he's won the ball And we very much hope you'll join us for more live Premier League action on EA TV. It's Manchester City facing Everton. Into the final 20 minutes. Struggling to keep the ball.
He has teammates around him. And Bellingham in possession to give them the lead, maybe. It's got to be! High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that, and it was close. Well, his skill level is so high, you're absolutely right. That's a great effort on the volley. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Could be! Oh, a powerful effort. Close. Tavernier. And very deftly cut out. Can they grab the lead late on? Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been for the keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. Gundogan. And he's through here. Well, the post getting in the way there. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Well, that would probably have been the winner. It's so unlucky. Is there going to be a dramatic finish here? Let's hope so. Well, a game of such fine margins, but let's see if they can create another opportunity. Breaking at pace. Well, the atmosphere is so tense inside this stadium, but can they find that moment of magic to win this game? The crowd certainly thinks so. Just listen to them. Well, they might be onto something. The end product just wasn't there. Based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. Locked together then, these two sides. And on we go now. And now it is all about the penalty shootout. And he finds the net. He could hardly miss. And he steps up to take the shot. Goalkeeper beaten from the spot. And up he comes, doing his best to remain focused. Job done from the spot. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. And that was an exquisitely taken penalty. Well, dead centre with that penalty. Composure is so important under these trying circumstances. Oh, he saved it! And confidently converted. Can he remain calm? In it goes! So much on the line with regard to this penalty. And it is a masterful save to take them through to the last four. Oh, he's the hero, isn't he? A huge moment for them. Such a tough game too. Really could have gone either way. But they have to fancy their chances of reaching the final now.
And the game begins. Walker. Foden. Can he put it away? And a goal it is! No long wait for the opener today. And Everton get the ball rolling once more. Let's find out how they're going to react to this setback. Calvert Lewin. Not a great pass. Tremendous ball played through and getting across to stop it. Kevin De Bruyne with the corner. Oh, a really good header, but the goalkeeper there to cover up. It might still be problematic. It's always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Just not looking confident in possession. And the flag is up for offside. Error in judgment, you might say. Oh, he's got to let that run. He must have known he was in an offside position. Gray. Might be a chance here. Well, fine play, and maybe it'll set something up. Kevin De Bruyne. Bernardo Silva. Hold on! Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Keeping it moving dynamically. Chilwell, can he play it in? Holland, and it might be. And a fantastic diving save. Well, not the best clearance. What a block. Well, really calm, composed goalkeeping there. It's so So into the second half, can Everton battle back after that first 45? Looking for that final pass and for that chance to level the game. Rodri intercepting it intelligently. Bernardo Silva, can he put it away? And a goal! They've increased their lead and they don't want to be throwing it away from here. So the ball rolling again at 2-0. Well, the flag has gone up here. Offside it is. Holland, Erling Holland, And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. And as they restart the game, it's fair to say the gulf in quality between the two sides has been huge. And foul it is then. And there is the goal! He's found the net! Joy unconfined! So there it is. 3-1 the current scoreline here. Chance to play it in. It's still alive! Just the challenge that was required. Holland. Walker, and he's made headway. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Foden. Bernardo Silva. It's still there for him. Chilwell. Can they convert? Oh, wonderful goalkeeping. Well, you have to say, from that sort of distance, that's a wonderful save. Rodri. Foden. He'll have a go here. Well, it ended up being easier for the goalkeeper in the end. And they have possession again. Will he play it in? Pretty comfortable piece of defending. And that is that full time here and a win for City. Your verdict? Well, Derek, they were better than their opponents in all aspects of the game. They defended well enough, they dominated midfield and they created chances as well. It was a great performance.
And now they get the ball rolling. City pushing forward with options available. Junior Firpo. Not high quality defending. Chilwell. On the ball, Rafael Leao. And the advantage is with City. Holland and Kevin De Bruyne with the goal. And what a boost that will be for his side. Now back underway and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Rodrigo. Oh, there it is! A back and forth sort of match. Now they're level again. The lead lasted merely minutes. So back underway. One goal apiece here. Oh, great defending. Stuart Dallas. And now passing it through. A goal here. Giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1. Patient build-up at the moment. Well, visionary passing. McKenney. My goodness, the importance of getting there was not lost on the keeper. Rafael Leao. Now he must favour the cross. De Bruyne. And a long way out. Well, the keeper made the save pretty easily in the end. Four shot. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. And a change to the scoreline in the Fulham game. Alex Scott can tell us more. It's a goal for Newcastle. Apologies for jumping in, but this could be a chance. Rifled against the post, but back in play. Oh, good save. Favouring the short one. Foden. And that is the sort of tackle he had scripted in his mind. Counter-attacking very much an option. Rodrigo. Can he put it in? And a goal! He's doubled his total for the day in superb scoring form. So back underway at 3-1. Well, apologies to Alex for having to cut her off when we did. To confirm, Newcastle United have scored in that match. They now lead by one goal to nil. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Now, this could really lift spirits. A goal! That's two for him today. They simply can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating. And the ball is moving again. 3-2. Aronson, good tackle but I believe there's been a goal at Stamford Bridge Alex Scott can fill us in yes it's a goal for Chelsea nice build up play and when the space opened up boy did he take it well they're ahead by two now with 61 minutes played many thanks Alex well Leeds aren't controlling the possession here but when they have had it they've looked so dangerous oh no, Stuart they might be onto something Oh, a save of the highest order. Well, he got his angles absolutely right. What a good save that is. Time for a change then. Oh, blocked it! Nyonto. And attempting the through ball. And the keeper more than equal to it. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, you can't really head them any better than that. But the goalkeeper was up to the task. 
And the referee has given the corner. So maybe scope here for them to add to their lead. On a pass that lacks quality. Well, they've given him too much space. Will he find the net? Ederson and goal made it look easy. And he's through here. Terrific save. Well, that's a top-class save. He read it so well. Good-looking move, this. Well, got there in the end. That's the important thing. De Bruyne. Now we're inside the final ten minutes in this one. They've got to be really mindful of the time situation, attacking though they might be. Well, make sure you join us for more Premier League action coming your way. It's Leeds United facing Fulham. I like the look of that game. The atmosphere is always good inside that stadium and two very good teams. And the degree of difficulty wasn't all that high in terms of the save. Getting in there to intercept. Getting forward. Well, let's see about the cross. Well, it came to nothing in the end. And he read it superbly. Holland. Tremendous ball played through. And he's in. What late excitement. And the... Match is level. Well, let's take another look. And you have to say the defending is so poor. That's far too easy. The keeper had no chance there. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. And it's positive from Matt. And the referee brings this contest to an end. Well, it was keenly fought. A share of the spoils. Rifled against the post, but back in play.
This should be one to savour. Manchester City get the contest underway. On the offensive. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Gundogan threading it through. Calvin Phillips. This looks promising. Oh, really close. Just over the top. Saka. Gundogan. Well, he took care of it defensively. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Gundogan. And a goal. 1-0 it is. They've been pushing for the opener. And now they have it. For Manchester City. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? It's opening up for them. Poor attempt at a pass, really. March. Not the easiest of situations for the keeper. Well, the defender deserves a bit of credit, to be fair. Yeah, I think you have to give credit to the defending there. Just enough pressure to put him off at that vital moment. Bellingham and he read it well an effective ball and a chance he's got to score it's still alive and I think the threat has been averted Gundogan oh surely Bellingham and turned onto the woodwork So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. And slipped through by Ilkay Gundogan and running in behind and he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. Must be. And there it is. A two-goal cushion now and they just need to keep the concentration. So underway once more. 2-0 the lead here. Strength and control, a big part of his game. Magnificent defending. Gundogan. Saka. Alvarez. He takes aim. A goal! Another one! It's turning into an absolute demolition job.
A game that should be chock full of drama here at the Emirates. Plenty to look forward to. Always a terrific venue to watch a football match. I'm talking about the Emirates Stadium here in North London. My name's Derek Ray, and delighted to have alongside me, as usual on these occasions, Stuart Robson. And live action to come from the oldest cup competition of them all, the FA Cup. It's Arsenal facing Manchester City. Well, Derek, it's a nice break from league action today for these clubs. Obviously a long way to go in the tournament. The final is months away, but they want to put in a good performance and get through to that next round. Just not looking confident in possession. Advantage, Arsenal. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Jorginho in the centre of midfield. And the centrepiece of the attack today is Gabriel Jesus. You know, it's always a tantalising prospect watching Martin Odegaard close up. Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box. Oh, they could put it away, Stuart. An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Well, here's the replay, and he's got to clear his lines there. He doesn't do that. He has his pocket picked, and he's been rightly punished. Poor defending. On they go again, and Arsenal know they need to wipe out that last goal. Bernardo Silva. And teammates around him. But really sticking to the task defensively. Gabriel Jesus Partey options in the centre a very good tackle Bernardo Silva Leal now delivering that deep cross oh but claimed by the goalkeeper Foden nicely timed tackle Gabriel Jesus Bernardo Silva and threading it forward well, without wanting to put too fine a point on it, that goes down as a tame effort and easy for the keeper. It's Arsenal's turn now. He's enjoying space. Gabriel Jesus. Oh, it strikes the bar. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Well, City haven't bossed the possession, as you can see, but their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good display from them so far. Leal. Maximum commitment, and he's given away the corner. Going short. He certainly has time. Oh, marvellous defending to deny him. Holland. Can he open them up here? Really vital interception. And Bernardo Silva has it. Leal. And given the defender's touch, the referee says corner. And the short option preferred. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. The has indicated there will be a minimum of one minute. Holland, can he make it count? And the keeper more than equal to it. And there we have it. The first half action is over here at the Emirates. Not a lot to like about Bernardo Silva and his performance so far. What have you made of it? 
Well, Derek, he took his goal well. Second half underway, with City looking to build upon a positive first half performance. Holland, chance for Bernardo Silva, and the keeper more than equal to the task. Surely, oh, magnificent reaction. He succeeds in clearing it. Well, PSG have been busy in the transfer market. The contract situation has been signed and sealed, and he could be available as early as their next game, Stuart. Well, he's a great talent. Hopefully, this move will see him play these best week in, week out. It's a really good move oh, for sorry, everybody. Oh, sorry, Stuart, look at this. Well denied by the keeper, but really, he only has himself to blame. Now a potentially dangerous position for City. Ronaldo Silva. Foden. And not cleared away properly. Well, good defending. Clattered out of there. Well, that save could be the turning point here because they've been second best all over the pitch up to now. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. And the ball played over from the flank. But meat and drink to Laporte. Well, we always enjoy bringing you live action on EA TV and Premier League action coming up. A big moment here, Derek. Superb save. Well, he should score, of course. But that's a brilliant save. Partey. What a big chance that was. Keeper has the ball. Leal. Opportunity here. Danger averted for now, but they have a corner to defend. Well, he's gone into the referee's notebook. And he can't be surprised. That was a poor challenge, you have to say. Now, how about the short corner? Making sure it didn't get past him. Rodri. up defensively racing forward trying to catch them out well, it was a good counter-attack in the making but very alert defending well, delighted to say more Premier League action coming up for you here on EA TV it's Manchester City taking on Chelsea I'm really looking forward to that two entertaining teams in what should be a really feisty affair is it going to be the importance of that tackle cannot be overstated Holland now looking dangerous here and there it is a penalty given and a chance perhaps for them to finish this off well no card handed out but quite a few upset players out there Stuart well he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball so penalty yes yellow card no and this might mean job done and he finds the net no difficulties encountered Well, as you can see, the keeper makes no effort in the end. He was hoping it would be struck down the middle, but it's an easy finish, really. 2-0 here, and the ball is moving again. Martin Erdegaard, and a tidy challenge. Oh, what an opportunity! And there it is! That will put the seal on victory if there were any lingering doubts.
Well, just look how exposed the keeper is. He's got absolutely no chance there, but they do take it well, you have to say. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. No way through. Well, he didn't really trouble the keeper. To be fair, the angle was tight. Well, I'm not sure that was the right option. Oh, poor from the keeper. Well, after that mishap, the keeper can now exhale. Well, the hand goes up apologetically. That was a real lapse in concentration there. Martin Odegaard. He continues his run. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. It might be. Nicely saved. The final whistle then, and Manchester City progress. Well, it was all at a bit of a canter, to be honest. They dominated pretty much from the start, and it left the result in little doubt. Potentially one to savour. Arsenal... Thank you everyone for joining us. We're going to start questions now. Guys, we're now out of time. It is invariably a highlight of any season. Two clubs who represent an unbridled commitment to success. Stay with us for all the action live from the Etihad as Manchester City face Chelsea on EA TV.
Hello and welcome to the Etihad Stadium. My name is Derek Ray and my commentary partner on this occasion is Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It is Manchester City taking on Chelsea. Well, thanks Derek as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Introducing the starting players for Manchester City. John Stone starts alongside Manuel Akanji in central defence. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And here's how it looks for Chelsea. Kalidou Koulibaly plays with Stefan Savic in central defence. N'Goro Conte starts with Matteo Kovacic in the centre of midfield. And the striker today is Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. It ought to be a really interesting battle. Chelsea kick off. Mount. Now potential danger. In it goes. An early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. So City get things going again. And the onus is on them to erase the damage done by that concession. Very quick thinking there. And a good looking ball. Obama Yang. Oh, just wide of the mark. Goal kick. Well, that never looked like troubling the keeper, did it? But it was worth an effort. A good strike from him. Keeper not concentrating. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next. And perhaps a goal from this free kick. Well, a brilliantly executed free kick. So near, Stuart. Well, he'll have practiced that time and time again. It's a fantastic bit of technique, but he just can't get it down in time. Good bit of pressing. Mount. Gets it a go. Well, he really wants his brace. Well, he looks so bright today. His movement has been excellent. Jude Bellingham. Here's Alvarez. Take it away. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Pulisic now. Conte. Is this the moment? The save was a good one. Playing it short. And delivered into the box. On a time for composure on the ball. This might be ideal for the counter. Oh, maybe the equaliser. And that's what they needed, Manchester City. A goal to level matters here. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. But there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't... ...reacting time. It's a great strike. Loftus-Cheek. <laughs> Reese James. Well read to win possession back. And the advantage is with City. Oh, and a perfect ball now. How about this? And, and turned onto the woodwork. And the keeper hangs on at the second attempt. Well, he's done really well, hasn't he? Great stop, and then the reaction. Well, visionary passing. Credit to them for winning back possession.
Grealish. Now Gundogan. Slipshod passing. Breaking at pace. Pulisic. Well, he could run onto it here. Oh, a vital piece of last-ditch defending. Takes the shot. Oh, incredible save, and he snuffed out any sign of danger. And a retrospective yellow card is the referee's verdict. Well, no doubt about it. That earlier challenge was a definite booking. Well, no real accuracy, and easy for the keeper. a move of great promise they could easily have been in Obama Young and Chelsea moving the ball forward what can they do from here could cross it in here Kovacic well it had a chance but off the crossbar and a goal kick Jude Bellingham he's given it straight to the opposition if you're wondering about stoppage time one minute to be added on now able to close down the short and there we have it that brings to an end the first half here at Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. A City free kick forthcoming. And he was flirting with trouble, but the referee has decided not to hand out a yellow card. Mount. Read it superbly to take back possession. Well, we wondered if this deal was going to be done. In fact, it has now been done, Stuart. Well, he's a great talent. Hopefully, this move will see him play at his best week in, week out. It's a really good move for everybody. Stones. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Pulisic Mount Plenty of support here Really good challenge Mateo Kovacic Useful play. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Well, this is certainly the home of live football, EA TV, and looking forward to bringing you more action from the Premier League. It's Manchester City facing Crystal Palace. Mount. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Passing high, and they have the ball again. But after that... Fantastic effort. It's gone out for a throw-in. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer, and you have to say it was on the cards. Having conceded, Manchester City know they've got to come up with a response. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Obama Young. 
Aubameyang. The save was a good one. And they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. It's not a particularly good corner there. Foden. Oh, the threat is there. It's got to be. And it's gone in. Just what was needed for Manchester City, who now have squared it. Well, back underway here. And they've split the four goals between them so far. Joao Felix. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. Well, just to point you in the right direction, we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's Chelsea taking on Brighton. And Chelsea get the decision from the referee. Well, they've decided to make a change. And Chelsea still knocking on the door in the closing minutes. Can they find a winner? Jude Bellingham Phil Foden now when you're on a yellow card you've really got to tread oh so carefully well now he's walking on eggshells you might say next time it'll be yellow Alvarez the supporters want to see him have a go well he stopped them just when they looked menacing Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, goodness me, into the goalkeeper's grateful grasp. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, two minutes to be added on. Well, these City fans are demanding a winner here, but can the players respond? They're certainly playing better now. And with that, the referee brings this contest to an end. All square here in what was a thoroughly compelling game. Potentially exciting 90 minutes here, and Manchester City get the ball rolling. I must say, this looks promising. Shot attempted, and a fine stop. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Hughes, what a shocking pass, really. A real opening now. Zaha flinging himself at it, the keeper. Hughes, body on the line. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Can they forge ahead? He read it well. He's managed to get in behind. High echelon goalkeeping there. Potential opportunity for Manchester City to take the lead. Corner kick it is. Rodri. 
Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw-in. Can he put them ahead? Oh, wonderful goalkeeping! Well, you have to say, from that sort of distance, that's a wonderful save. Just had to keep his concentration to the maximum, and he did. Rodri. Rodri. Hold on! In it goes! Well, the pressure has been mounting, and now they have the lead! So, underway again here. one nil. The... And the second half is underway with Palace behind. Can they turn this game around? It's going to be interesting to see. And cuts inside. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. Rodri. Bowden. It's a promising City move. It's there for him. And it's gone in. Just what the doctor ordered. Things look... We simply have to focus on this man. Three goals in three games, and you can't argue with that. We're live on EA TV. And a warm welcome. Our venue today is the Etihad Stadium here in Manchester. I'm Derek Ray, getting ready to bring you all the action, accompanied by my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And we have live action from the FA Cup to bring you today. It is Manchester City, and they take on Coventry City. Thanks, Derek. Well, the hosts are clear favourites going into this tie. But with that comes pressure, particularly against a team that will remain compact, are well-drilled defensively, and are a threat on the counter-attack. If the hosts don't go through, though, it will be a major upset. Introducing the starting players for Manchester City. John Stone starts alongside Manuel Akanji in central defence. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. The referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City. Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner. But this man might be a decent shout. What are you expecting to see from him, Stuart? Oh, Derek, big moment here. Good stop from the keeper. Yes, 
shot corner taken. And he takes on the shot. There it is. A delightful start to this match. Just what they were hoping for. Well, here it is again. It's a well-delivered ball into the box. And then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. 1-0 then. Now, options are plenty. In with a chance. Majestic piece of goalkeeping. Well, he loves the big moments, doesn't he? And he's proved it again there. Great goalkeeping. Well, a short corner here. Behind for another corner. Can they cash in? They favoured a short one here. John Stones. Oh, big opportunity. And a goal! The quick one, too. And they've turned this game on its head. Well, just look how exposed the keeper is. He's got absolutely no chance there, but they do take it well, you have to say. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. really want him to shoot well, straight at the goalkeeper then good effort here oh goodness gracious me it's a special special goal from miles out Well, here it is again, and wow, just take a look at this. He's absolutely nailed this one. What a strike that is from distance. So the action continues, and City really cantering to victory here. Plenty of support here. Can he put it in? A goal! And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Walker. A sloppy pass. Well, City, as the stats highlight, have had most of the ball. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. Walker. An incisive pass. Just needs to stay calm. Off the post and back in play. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Well, they won't come much closer than that. It's a matter of inches from being a really good goal. Well, they have to have that sense of self-belief. It could happen for them. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And he's broken free. Oh, there it is! It's one goal after another, and it speaks to the quality of that performance. Blistering first half display, and just look at that score. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Half time, that will do it for the first half here at the Etihad.
And we're focusing on him for a reason, Stuart. He's asking plenty of questions of the defenders. Well, he's been brilliant today. His skill, his movement, his goals. What... The second half is underway, and it's Manchester City with the lead. Tyler Walker, really good challenge. Oh, that's a really good run. Well, whatever way you slice it, a long, long way from the target, Stuart. Well, a lack of technique and composure there. That's a bad miss. Well, how about this for a transfer story? 100% official now, I'm told. The deal has gone through. Dusan Tadic has completed his move to Sporting, Stuart. Well, I think he's still got a few years left in him. He still looks fit and sharp and still has that desire. What a good signing this could be. So, making the substitution now. Played over. Not the best clearance. Brilliantly blocked. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. Will it be? Didn't fool the keeper. And with play stop, they will make the change now. But he's gone short with it. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Well, he was being pressed, but did his job. Moving forward effectively. Now, will the cross work out for them? Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. So they restart the game, and only one team in it. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Well, he was on his own, but couldn't take advantage of it. Well, I'm not surprised he missed that. He never really looked in complete control, did he? And there to intervene. Real chance. And there is the goal. He's found the net. Joy unconfined. City goal, number 18, Sean McGuire. Ake. And now Stones. Bukayo Saka. Just 15 minutes remaining. Alvarez. He takes aim. And there is the goal to make it a hat trick. Excellence in finishing. There Well, as you can see, the defending is all over the place. That's far too easy for the attackers. The goalkeeper's got absolutely no chance there. Nicely cut out. Stones. And now it's Phillips. Still alive. And relief as the keeper holds on. Well, he reacts so quickly, doesn't he? That's a great bit of work from him. And very deftly cut out. Now oh, that pass easy on the eye. Now, will they do it from here? Oh, there it is! It's one goal after another, and it speaks to the quality of that performance. Well, just look how exposed the keeper is. He's got absolutely no chance there, but they do take it well, you have to say. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now.
Well, visionary passing. And denied by the... And in at the second time of asking. Just what was required. Well, here it is again, and I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper. He makes a good save to start with, but where are his defenders following in? Instead, it's the attacker who's alert. He gets to the ball first, and it's a good finish. As far as stoppage time is concerned, three minutes here. Matt Godden, determined defending. Breaking at pace. Oh, what an opportunity! Much to the sheer delight of the fans. There's the final whistle and Manchester City move on. Yeah, it doesn't come much easier than that, does it? I thought they played well and it was an excellent overall performance, particularly going forward. They'll certainly be confident going into the next round. Well, they put in a really thorough performance here, Stuart. And they kick off here. Might be able to set up the chance. Well, it all counts for naught. Phil Foden. And back with De Bruyne. Oh, that's fine goalkeeping. Real concentration. And a short corner, let's see. Diaz. De Bruyne. Can he convert? And the keeper more than equal to the task. And the referee felt he had to blow the whistle. Bernardo Silva. The supporters want to see him have a go. And fine goalkeeping. It's a short corner. Well, oh, they'll try to keep the pressure on in the form of another corner. And how about the short corner? And winning it back. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. He's in here. And just making the run a bit too early. Offside as a result. Rodri. Holland. Fruitful looking attack. 
But a crucial intervention inside the box. Rodri. And the keeper able to hold on to it. Chance here. Calvert Lewin. Gray. Can he play it in? And a really single minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Bernardo Silva. Being pressed and pressed hard. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Covert Lewin, poor pass. Foden, well shown inside. And Bernardo Silva has it. Well, very effective play in possession. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Erling Haaland. Leal. Now with Chilwell. Haaland! A goal to give them a 1-0 lead. An excellent value for that advantage, you've got to say. So, Everton restart the game. Well aware that the pressure has been applied. How will they respond? Bernardo Silva distributing intelligently. And a goal! The quick one, too! And they've turned this game on its head!